Here is the STB emulator version 10.2.4 just released. This version has full function on screen remote control. We do not need any external remote or apps anymore. Keep press to OK or enter button on the remote and the remote control with the five main keys will pop up on screen. On top we have settings, on the right side we have the menu, at the bottom we have Mac remote control keys and on the left keyboard. In settings, the one on the left will open application settings. The next key will open the current profile to check or edit the details. The third key opens up key mapping page, a special feature for expert users. The fourth key is to close the app. It is important to close the app when not in use. App running in the background will cause conflicts and performance issues. With the fire stick, pressing menu button will close the app. The bottom key opens up Macbox remote control keys. Red, green, yellow and blue buttons for functions like sorting, setting favorites, search, etc. Always wait for the keys to go off screen and then make the selections. Color buttons in video club. Red is for viewing, green is for sorting, yellow for marking favorites and blue for search function. Video club sorting options. The search is little time sensitive. Make sure that all is selected and the entire list is available for search. Wait for the remote keys to go off screen before you hit the search option. Get the on screen keyboard from the left as shown and enter minimum three letters to enable search or more to narrow down the results. Bottom row has video playback controls. Play, fast forward, rewind and stop. These keys come in handy with the devices like Google TV Chromecast and some Android TVs where remote control is very lean with only basic functions. A closer look at the playback controls. The key marked X in the left is the back or return button. TV key at the bottom right is to switch to TV mode from another mode. Menu keys open up on the right side. On top we have profiles. This is useful to quickly reload a profile. Next is the media player selection. In Fire Stick, only EXO player works. In Google TV Chromecast, all players work. Next is the audio tracks, not for stalker portal. Subtitles button will work with the EXO player if the server supports subtitles. Next is the aspect ratio selection. Best to leave it in auto or play around with the different options. On the left, we have the keyboard button. The number keys do not work. The button with the keyboard icon next to zero will open up alphanumeric keyboard. Do not open keyboard when it is not required. It will stay stuck on the screen. Only way out is to go back to home screen and restart the app. To sum up, but for some minor issues when used in Fire Stick, this version makes up for the long awaited remote control limitation. Keep checking Google Play Store for further updates and also related videos in this channel. Thanks for watching and do post your comments and questions.